Here are the 7 types of axe heads. So, let's get started. Number 1. Tactical Axe. The tactical axe is a modern invention, which is something of a multi-tool. Also commonly known as a tactical tomahawk, this axe has gained popularity among law enforcement officers, soldiers, and security staff, as well as survivalists. The primary use of this axe is chopping, but it can also function as a close-range weapon, a shovel, a pry bar, and a hammer. It's ideal for camping trips, as it can help with cooking, chopping wood for campfires, and digging holes. Number 2. Grub Axe. Also known as a cutomatic, a grub axe has a head with an axe on one side and an adz on the other side. The axe blade will be at a vertical angle, while the adz blade, which is the longer of the two, will be at a horizontal angle. The name grub axe comes from the way the tool is used, as it is great for grubbing in compacted soils and rough terrain. Number 3. Felling Axe. These axes are specifically designed for felling trees and chopping logs of wood. The head of a felling axe will weigh between 2 and 4 pounds, and sit at the end of a long handle. This long handle enables the user to produce a more powerful swing with greater leverage, making for a better cut. Traditionally the handles are made from hickory wood, which is strong. The grain of the hickory should follow the handle lengthways and curve along with it, for superior strength. Number 4. Forest Axe. Forest axes are robust axes that are solely used for felling trees. They are extremely heavy-duty tools and are too cumbersome to carry around on camping trips, but it would be great to store permanently at a cabin in the woods. These axes have extra long handles and are intended to cut down very large trees. A forest axe will have a sharp and flared blade with a slightly curved tip. Number 5. Hudson Bay Axe. This type of medium-sized axe was designed by Canadian fur trappers. They used it to chop firewood while on extended trips to the cold north, and also as an all-purpose axe for other tasks. Size-wise, it is in between that of a hatchet and a full-sized felling axe. It can be used with one hand or with both, and is good for smaller chopping and splitting jobs. Number 6. Hatchet. A hatchet is a general all-purpose axe, and is the kind of axe that most people own for light jobs in the yard. These can range enormously in price, from just a few dollars to $100 plus. They are relatively small compared to some other axes, with a chunky handle most commonly made from hickory wood. The head is weighted, with a flared shape that comes to a sharp-tipped blade. Number 7. Splitting Maul. These axes are specifically designed for splitting logs into kindling. They have a design very similar to a felling axe, with a long wooden handle to give a good swing. When using a splitting maul, you should use a downward swing, not a sideways swing like that used for a felling axe. Unlike felling axes, which cut against the grain of the wood, splitting mauls cut with the grain, which is what results in split wood rather than chopped wood. <laughs>